Streams 038 is out, and as always, we have for you a short video going through the main changes. This release has over 110 PRs from over 15 contributors. In this release, we support Kubernetes 1.21 and newer, and the last tested version is Kubernetes 1.28.2. The supported Apache Kafka versions are 3.6.0, 3.5.1 and 3.5.0. The support for Kafka 3.4 has been removed. Before we jump to the main new features, let's talk for a while about deprecations and removals. We decided to deprecate the Strums environment variable config provider. The reason for that is that Apache Kafka has now its own environment variable config provider, which works in the same way. So it doesn't make sense to maintain both of them please switch to use the Apache Kafka config provider. The Strumzy provider will still be there until Strumzy 042, when it will be removed. The, another removal is that the type field and the listener status in the Kafka custom resource will not be used anymore from this release on. It has been deprecated already in Strumzy 028, and as an alternative, you can use the name field instead. With the removals and deprecations out of our way, we can now look at the new features. The first one is broker scale down check. What we see sometimes among our users is that they scale down a Kafka broker that is not completely empty and still has some partition replicas assigned. When the streams the operator scales it down, these partition replicas might be missing and they might cause problems down the road, for example, with rolling updates. So with the broker scale down check, the Strumzy operator now checks whether the broker is really empty before removing it. And if it's not empty, it lets you to empty it first. If you want to scale down a broker node which is not empty and you want to do it intentionally, you can use an annotation to skip this check. We have also some improvements to our Kafka Connect and Kafka Mirror Maker 2 support. When we introduced the Stable Connect Identities feature gate and started using Strumzy pod sets to run the Connect and Mirror Maker 2 clusters, we didn't give our users any easy way how to roll all the pods belonging to the cluster. Now, in Strumzy 038, we add support for the manual rolling update annotation. You can use it to roll all pods belonging to Connect or Mirror Maker 2 cluster. This is the same annotation that you can already use to roll the Zookeeper cluster or the Kafka brokers. And it works the same way for Connect and Mirror Maker 2. We also added support for stopping Connect and Mirror Maker 2 connectors. This is a new feature supported from Kafka 3.5. You can stop the connectors using the new state field in the Kafka connector and Kafka Mirror Maker 2 custom resources. As a part of our work on the craft support, you can now also run Zookeeper and craft-based clusters in parallel. To do that, you should enable the use craft feature gate and use the strumzy.io slash craft annotation to annotate the Kafka custom resources that should be used for craft-based Kafka clusters. We have also some improvements to the new unidirectional topic operator. We now support pausing the reconciliation of the Kafka topic resources and have support for Prometheus metrics. From 0.38 on, we are also signing our container images using the cosign tool, and we are publishing the software bill of materials for them as well. We have also updated several dependencies, including the Strumzy bridge and the Strumzy OAuth library. And there are, of course, many other improvements and bug fixes as well. And that's it for this release. Hope you enjoy it and don't forget to star us on GitHub, follow us on Twitter and subscribe to our YouTube channel.